All right, so y'all just seen all the all the superstars that John Ross could get. He can get pretty much everything except for playmaker. Like he gets red zone threat. Like I I thought T O was like the only receiver that could get that in this game. It may be other ones, but I ain't think John Ross would be one of them. So right after I bought him, I went into a game and I messed up with this dude, Reed. Reed. I don't even know what his name is, but he he made it all the way to a Super Bowl with a bronze team. Like. I'm y'all seen his top three straight bronze. I'm a, I'm gonna pause the game and show it. His whole team. I think he had a goal kicker, but that was about it. Like he had a starter up team and made it to a Super Bowl. I think what EA wanted me to do, EA tried to match me up with him so he so he can get wood, and then now he buys packs. But then uh, I had to quit off the game from I I you know I had to throw a couple touchdowns to John Ross. I had to get some freebies from this team because I didn't know if the next game I got into, I was gonna be able to uh, if I was gonna be able to throw a touchdown to him. Right here, I'm throwing a touchdown. I lied, Michael Vick. I that's the 94 Mike Vick, so I can't even be mad. And I lobbed it. I could have just bullied it. But at first, it looked like the corner was running step by step. That's why I just lobbed it up. But then I guess when they get down the field, he was just uh run right past him. Is that Orlando Scandrick? Oh, nah, Sensible. Co Cody Sensible. Something like that. But yeah, after that touchdown, looked at his team. I, I had to get like two more touchdowns in on him. Straight bronzes. I don't even know why you would even load up in a game with straight bronzes, even at the beginning of the year, but let alone in March, when like everybody has a way higher overall team. I don't know if this was like he was doing some type of challenge, but I don't even know how you make it all the way to the Super Bowl with straight bronzes. And I kicked it to his fullback like three straight times. He fumbled three straight times. Tommy Bohannon, I think that's who it was. Tillman smacked him. But this combine promo, I don't know if I really like it this year because everybody can get 99 speed. So there's like no point. There was no point in upgrading Dion because his last card could get 99 speed. So I, I don't know. Hopefully next year they find something to do about that. I really think personally they should take take out power ups. But that's just me. But they got to do something about it because there's just no way that nobody cares about the combine promo. I remember like Taylor Mays used to be in the combine. Uh, Desmond Trufant had a card in Madden 15. It was like a it was some good people who was like kind of tall, fast that you that you would buy. But I don't I don't know. It just seemed like everybody has 99 speed in this matter. So yeah, I just quit out that I touched down. He he won't playing no more. I only think he touched the ball on offense. That whole game. He just fumbled three straight times on a uh, kickoff. Then I got into this game. It was sending strong close. Having, I don't know what's up with everybody in strong close. Like, I, got, I don't, I don't know. Everybody got strong close with Darren Waller. Luckily, this dude didn't have Darren Waller activated, cause then I wouldn't have been able to come out in uh, three for odd. I would have had to run like Nick or Norm or something. But I played a dude before who was in strong close with uh. What's the dude's name? Uh, Darren Waller. That dude is a problem. Mis mismatch Nightmare as a whole is a problem, but when you want a running formation in it, like you got to try and stop the run and watch the tight end. It's kind of crazy. Right there, to be honest, I'm surprised Devin Bush even did anything. Like linebackers, like Brian are like about to make a play right here too. I don't know what, I don't know. I guess some days they want to act like they know how to play football. Some days they don't. Maybe it was just Brian Lacker being 6'4 right there. And that's the that's only the 95. I powered him down to uh, buy Ken Houston. But then I just sold Ken Houston to buy John Ross. I had to sell Ken Houston and uh, Andre Reed. Andre Reed, I don't know. I, I should trade Andre Reed for, um, for John Ross, obviously. In game, it says John Ross has 100 speed. Like, when you check the matchups, as I say that, look how, look how close Luke Keekly is to John Ross. And John Ross has 100 speed. Is that not crazy to anybody? Like, how is Luke Keekly even? He should not be on the screen when I'm running in the end zone. If I'm throwing it to John Ross. Like, he was a little too close now. And he ain't got no Panthers theme. He ain't got no type of theme to where that could be justified. The dude has 100 speed. Like, I remember Madden 16 at the beginning of the year with Brashad Perriman, 97 speed. Everybody else was so slow. If you snuck Perriman in the game and, like, nobody noticed, he will run right by whoever is by him because nobody was close to 97 speed. And he's like a 73 overall. 
But now, I don't know how I picked that off. I don't even have lurk on him. But now, you you can't just... Luke Keekley was just running that close to John Ross. And I don't know if y'all just seen it, but I just showed it. He had 100 speed if you uh, check the matchups. Luke Keekley should never be that close, bro. They just got to make it to where speed matters again. And here it is again, 5'11", 100 speed, 91 route. And with him only being 5'11", he looked kind of tall on the field, I'm not going to lie. And I ain't trying to be the one to complain, but I just feel like he should just run right past every linebacker. I understand the safeties who got like 95, 96 speed, because they're back super duper far up. But a linebacker just not getting burned by 100 speed is crazy to me. Right here, he put two people, he put a 6'3 maze and Tillman on him. So I just had to release my tight end, start to him. Right here, I didn't want to run that that play with the post over the top because it's too small and safeties ain't got nowhere to. See what I'm saying? Like when it gets so condensed, you can't throw that. But he's not going to guard the end route, so I'm just going to throw the end route again right to John Ross. Right here, I. I really could have just ran it in, but I thought he was gonna run commit, so I just try to get John Ross in the end zone for the uh yeah for the stats. And bro, Darren Waller, that dude is different. My John Ross was getting hawked down by Luke Keekley, but it took us that long to tackle Darren Waller. Stop the malarkey. All right, he tried to run that. He just ran a toss in, in this game. Tosses are super Bro, I, I don't know any toss. That one looked kind of good, though, because usually they, they pass them off so slow. But I don't know. I wouldn't even ever run a toss in this game. He tried Raw Woodson. I dropped a pick. He tried him again. That's that new 97 Raw Woodson, too. So he, if this game was close, he, he can't be dropping money like that. Because usually after somebody throws a pick and it's dropped, they just running the ball. That's that's really how, how you're supposed to do it, to be honest. You got to count your blessings and just run the ball, take three. Or anything you probably get in the end zone trying to run the ball right here look at i don't know i probably i probably could have threw it to be honest because sean taylor or whoever is safety was just backpedaling i could have threw it over him but i'm running the same play he ain't make a single adjustment i could have probably rack caught and just jukebox because i did put that on him but now i'm trying to You see, like, right there? That's what I mean. And I don't know how that's not picked up. Well, I guess he did, like, run the route to the fullest, to be honest. Like, I don't know what I was doing. Right here, this this little route was bait because I knew next time, next next play, he was going to come out and cover two. So, it's all right. Flat triangle, streak square. I don't know how Rob Woodson and the soft squad really just, I don't know. He played that superb, like. It was weird. He quit after that play anyway, so make sure you like, comment, subscribe. I'm